Hi, my name is David Cook and I am a security guard. Growing up, not a lot of people knew I was legally blind and um, that was definitely a big factor as far as people like, you know, judging and not judging me. That's been a battle in itself my whole life, you know what I mean? But I utilized it to my advantage, I feel like, because it kind of taught me how to never give up. Before I got connected with Workforce, um, I was doing a little bit of everything when it came to jobs as far as working. And for me, I was just tired of being stagnant and being stuck in one area and just, I didn't feel like I was doing enough for my family, you know what I mean? For my, for my baby girl at the time, uh, she was the only child. And I mean, she was very well taken care of, don't get me wrong, but I just wanted to be a, a more of a help for her, you know? And uh, at the time I was kind of like a stay at home dad and it wasn't like it was a big deal. I invested a lot of time into my daughter, it's my best friend realistically, but um, I just wanted to be able to do more for her outside of just spending time with her. I had went to go get my guard card on my own personally. And after I took that class, they recommended, hey, you know, if you guys want to go get this excess training. I knew that workforce existed, but um, I never really knew, I guess, exactly what they offered as far as like training and stuff goes. So once I was given that information, you know, I took it and ran with it. And the first day of training was actually a lot different just because I feel like they were, they were very more hands-on with the class that they were taking through the, you know, the program. Uh, because they were teaching us a lot more at that moment. And I felt like they were more adamant on making sure we knew what we needed to know. One of the teachers that I bonded with in specifics name was Derek. Uh, Derek has been more like a mentor to me as far as he had some of the things going on in life in his prior, you know, younger years, just like I do now. And, uh, you know, he gave me a lot of guidance as far as what I should do. I enjoyed, you know, the time that I had going there and working there and uh, just, you know, with the people that I did have in my corner helping me, they, they were amazing. At the end of training, we ended up with anywhere from 17 to 20 different certificates. Uh, we were given a placard for completing training. We did get a lot of different job offers, just depending on where you wanted to go. And they definitely placed us the best that they could. I am working full time for security and, um, just dealing with some of the people that I met in the, uh, at the program that I work at, it's, uh, I feel like it's fulfilling and it also definitely goes more into what I was looking into doing as far as trying to be able to be a help to the people that I am around. And that's definitely helped me in the long haul because there's certain things that I've been able to catch ahead of time. So it's like something that possibly was going to happen. Now I'm able to stop it, you know, before it even gets to that point, which I definitely feel like is a skill to have even outside of my job. And as far as my future, I just feel like the sky's the limit. You know, I'm just going to continue to grow and get better at what I'm doing. And I feel like there's no way to, to go but up, you know. I'd like to thank Fresno Regional Workforce Development Board for this award. And I'd also like to thank Paula. There was a time that I wanted to quit and without her being as motivational as she was and telling me that I could do this, I wouldn't have, you know, been here today doing what I'm doing, having this career that I have, anything like that. And um, she was definitely a big part of me being here now.